Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. For today's video, I am going to share with you my personal experience and as much as possible, the step-by-step -step process that I went through from Dubai until here in Manila, Philippines as an OFW during these pandemic times, okay? And just to let you know as well that I arrived here in Manila yesterday, which is on January 7, 2021, which means to say that all the videos or the processes that you are going to see right now are the latest version if you're wondering how it looks like uh, to come home here in the Philippines okay and right at the moment guys as you can see I am in a hotel room this is the hotel that is designated for me for my quarantine purposes until I got my swab test result and if you want to see the hotel tour or my room tour uh, make sure to watch until the end and I will give you a sneak peek on how it looks like to be quarantined in the hotel here in the Philippines. And if you're ready, let's get started. Hey guys, so this is it today. I'm going to leave Dubai. I'm going to go in Philippines. Yay! <laughs> Unfortunately, my husband cannot come because of COVID, but soon he will visit my family with me. So we are on the way to take some taxi. He take all my bag, I just have this big backpack but it's really light and then I have this really cute mini luggage. I see you in two, two months. Two months babe. <laughs> see, you. see you in the airport guys. So before I continue the video, let's talk about um, before our departure date, okay? So, pag may ticket na po kayo, kailangan po natin mag-fill up ng dalawang online form prior to our departure day. So, ano pa yung dalawang online form? Ito po yung oasis.oa.gov.ph, ito po siya, tsaka yung e-cif.redcross.org.ph. Ito din po siya. So, i-attach ko po yung dalawang link sa description box below para madali na lang po sa inyo. So, kailangan po natin itong fill up -an, along with our, our ticket kasi po uh, sa, sa fill up, may mga, may mga case na kailangan natin ilagay yung flight number tsaka yung seat number natin. Okay? So, pag na-fill up na po natin, pag may printer po kayo sa bahay, pwede niyo po itong i-print or pwede niyo lang pong i-save yung um, marireceive mo after mo ma-fill upan. So, for example, sa OWA, uh, magbibigay lang po sila ng confirmation na tapos na po kayo mag-fill up. So, make sure yung email address na ilalagay niyo po is correct para makareceive po tayo ng um, uh, verification sa kanila. Tsaka sa Red Cross naman po is uh, magsisend din po sila ng email along with a QR code. So, importante po yung QR code kasi ito po yung ipapakita natin sa Red Cross pagdating natin sa NAIA. Okay? So, Pwede niyo pong i-save or screenshot lang sa phone niyo or pwede niyo ding i-print, okay? Okay, so departure day na tayo. Um, prior to your departure time, guys, much better if pupunta kayo 4 to 5 hours before the time, okay? Bakit? Kasi kapag Cebu Pacific yung kinuha niyo po, um, sa Terminal 3, hindi po siya doon yung check-in ng luggages natin. Hindi sa loob ng Terminal 3. Kundi nasa tapat ng Terminal 3. So medyo malayo-layo siya. So, agahan natin ang pagpunta doon para maka-check in tayo. And then after niyo ma-check in yung luggages niyo, bibigyan kayo ng boarding pass. And then kasi yun din yung kailangan nating ipakita sa security guard pagpasok natin sa Terminal 3. Okay? So after niyo ma-check in, pasok ka agad sa Terminal 3, um punta ka agad sa immigration. After ng immigration, hanapin ka agad yung gate. Kasi yung tendency sa amin guys, yung gate na naka-assign sa Cebu Pacific, ang layo-layo. Sobrang layo niya, um, which took us uh, 15 to, I don't know, 15, 20 minutes I think, uh, by walk para mahanap yung um, gate namin. So agahan talaga natin yung pagpunta natin, okay? Tapos na akong mag-check-in guys. Tapos ngayon, papunta na kami sa, sa gate namin. Thank you 
for this fan. It's really worth it. <laughs> It's a Okay, ito na boarding na tayo, guys. Sa boarding naman po, may ibibigay silang dalawang card. Okay, ano po yung dalawang card? Ito po yung health declaration card. Um, yellow page siya, yellow card siya. At saka yung arrival card, which is yung brown card. Okay? Importante pong masagutan natin to or ma-fill up natin to, pwede po during sa plane. Doon na lang po sa plane. Okay? Huwag na lang po uh, habang pumipila papasok ng plane. Kasi hassle naman, gumagaling yung kakaros. Ang dami yung bagay, ganun. So, sa plane na lang po. Okay? Kasi ang haba naman ng oras natin sa plane, um, 9 hours yung biyahe, so marami tayong oras mag-fill up. Hi, we're going now in the airplane! This is it, Pansi. This is it, Pansi. Good thing, guys. Palaw ka sama. So, ito na guys yung pinakahihintay nyo. Ang paglabag natin sa Naiya. So, before tayo makalabas sa airplane guys, uh, meron po silang ay announce or meron po silang sasabihin kung ano po yung i-add nating information sa yellow card, sa health declaration card natin. Okay? So, makinig tayo na mabuti sa kanila kung ano yung dapat ilagay, tsaka ano po yung kailangan natin gawin paglabas natin sa airplane. Okay? So, sa process niya, uh, by row po yung paglabas ng mga tao para po for social distancing purposes. Okay? So, pag nakalabas na po tayo, um, maglakad lang po tayo, continue lang po tayo kasi yung unang madadat na natin is yung pagbigay natin yung health declaration form which is yung yellow card. Lahat kami dito, nasa likod ko. Isa lang kami ng airline, Cebu Pacific. Kunting kembot na lang. Nakakatulog na tayo, guys. Then, kuha na tayo ng luggage.
So guys, so ito yung pintuan ko sa room ko. Sa harap niyan, meron tayong painting tsaka maliit na lobby at ang unang sasalubong sa inyo is yung dining slash living room. Sayo lang yan, Besh. Sayong-sayo lang yan, as in, libre yan ng government. So, ayan, may dining table ka dyan, may pa-coffee pa. Tingnan nyo naman yung sala, Besh. O, oh, saan ka pa? Ang laki ng AC. O, oh, naka-on na yan. Pagdating nyo, on na yan, Besh. Tsaka may TV pa. Mm-hmm. Yan, o, oh, may cabinet ka pa. So, dito naman sa right side, Meron tayong fridge, complete set of uh, for washing. O, di ba? May binigay pa silang joy. Tsaka ganito. May patubig pa si Mayor. May laman ba to? Ah, yan. May laman ba lang to? Meron. And then, meron din silang microwave. Pwede ka magluto, pero nga, galing tayong ano. Wala tayong pang luto. <laughs> Tapos, punta na tayo sa the best part. Dito na tayo, Bash. Pagpasok mo, Ito yung kwarto mo. Sayong-sayo lang yan. O, oh, diba? O, oh, ang laki ng bed. Tapos, meron ka na namang TV. Andyan yung yung AC. Meron kang table dito. Tapos, may lampshade. Ay, sorry, hindi pala ito yung ano, button. Tsaka may mirror. Tsaka may Walk-in closet ka dyan. Meron pa silang pa-iron dyan. O, ba? O, may bolt. May mirror na naman. Ang linis ng toilet. O. O, ba? Nagpigay pa sila ng pa-toothbrush. Oh, my God. O. Sabay. Uy. Pwede ka pang maglaba, Besh. Ano na? Ikaw na talaga. O, ang ganda na. Oh, my God. May pabatab pa sila. Oh, my God. Hindi ko to in-expect. Ayan, o. May pabatab pa. Toilet. Oh. Oh. Wala <laughs> ka na ko. 